We have game five of the 2022 season and we have the Redbirds versus the Steamrollers. Both of these teams are 1-0 and with a win, that gives them a better shot at the number one seed. And each team is trying to stay perfect on the year. Arguably two of the best teams in the league and here is game five. We got the 1-0 Redbirds here. They had a great first game against the Badgers, but today might be a tougher test against the Steamrollers. The Steamrollers beat the Rip Tides in game one, had a great game. What are you guys' expectations for this game and you guys expect to win? Uh, I would definitely say I expect to win, but I do think it'll be a close matchup. I think it'll be low scoring. Uh, both teams have a great pitching duo. Really going to come down to who can get a ball over the fence first. Um, I mean, maybe we'll see multiple home runs, uh, but I, I would predict a low scoring game today. I think our pitching can hold them. We just got to get to them early. All right, we'll see if the Redbirds can have their first 2-0 start in a long time. I'm here with the Steamers captain, Joey DeMeo. You've already conquered one challenge, beating your former player, Jake Short, in the Riptides. But today, it's a tougher challenge. You have Adam, the number one pick of the Redbirds, and you have Chandler, who had a great game one. What are your expectations for this game? Um, Probably not going to be able to hit off Adam, but uh, hopefully hit off Luke. That's pretty much it. To get the barrels around, uh, pitch good. That's pretty much it. Redbirds, our home team. Adam is the starting pitcher for the Redbirds, and we have Joey DeMeo, captain of the Steamrollers. Here's the first pitch of game five, ball one. Nice pitch, 3-1. Four, two, count to Joey. Strike three! Makes Joey chase. Atta boy. Atta boy. <laughs> oh, what a pitch! Three and one. <laughs> <laughs> Kid yelled, come on, let's out there. That's kind of cool. Oh, what a pitch. Two strikes. Strike three. Great pitch. Two outs. Atta boy, Adam. All right, Luke, if you get two straight outs, you can sub. Luke Bradley is relieving for the Redbirds after Adam gets two outs. Yeah, Redbirds using a little bit of strategy today. We're gonna to try to have Adam face the top two as much as possible. Kyle, the seventh overall pick, his first AB in Como Blitzball. One and one to Kyle Belcher. Great pitch, strike two. And the Redbirds are almost out of this inning. One strike away, two strike pitch. Strike three. Oh, beautiful, beautiful, Luke. Top of the strike zone, great pitch by Luke. Let's go, baby. Let's go, Luke. Hell yeah. Damn. Here I got. You. Matt is the starting pitcher. For the steamrollers in game two. A little extra bad on the tape. You know, it's hot out here. Hands are sweaty. Knees weak. Arms are heavy. There's vomit on his sweater already. Mom's spaghetti. That's Eminem for all you kids back at home. Here's the first pitch. Matt Foster from KCBL. Foul ball. Chandler puts a piece on it. Oh, another foul ball. Oh, and play! Hits off the third base fence, and Chandler will have himself a single. One hopper to the fence. Chandler stays hot on the year. Great at bat there. I didn't lift very many weights, you know, this week, or else I would have gone over. Thank you, Joey. Four, one great pitch. Four, two. Two, strike pitch to Blake, Sappingfield. Strike three, Matt gets his first out of the inning. In play, Matt grabs it, and Adam is out at first. Chandler running to third, and he will make a great base running by Chandler. Good work. But Matt makes the play at first to Joey. Adam's out. It's so hard to run, it's so slippery. Oh my goodness. Strike two. <sighs> come on, Luke, come on. Four, two count with two outs in the bottom of the first. Strike three. All right. Matt gets out of the jam. We are through one, scoreless. We're gonna need a swing. We need, to, we need the bats around. Inning two, Luke Bradley's still in the pitch. Batting cleanup for the Steamers is Noah Swafford. But hey, they're playing a little bit strategic right now. I don't like it. It's like kind of like Clash Royale. Two strikes. Thought tip. Was that okay? Hits Noah in the arm. That will be strike three. One out in the inning on three pitches for Luke. 
Oh, now they're bringing Adam back in. Now the Redbirds are bringing Adam back in after Luke Bradley successfully strikes out two batters. Great pitch. Two strikes. Oh, how did Joey foul tip that? Don't know how I hit that. Strike three. Every single steamroller player has struck out so far. Yeah, thanks, Caden. Yeah, that really helps. Oh, great pitch by Adam. Two outs, one strike away from the Redbirds. Striking out the side again. Two outs. Strike three. Redbirds have pitched the six batters this game and six strikeouts. Looks like the Redbirds are targeting Joey and Matt with pitching Adam to them. What's up, boys? Back on the mic. I have a cannon, so if it's coming my way, I'm going to... Bottom of the second, Joey DeMeo coming in for the steamrollers. <laughs> Strike one. Oh my in God. play to Joey. Will he make the catch? That's one. Shayla makes contact with the first two pitches. One on one. Ball six. Blake will get on base with a walk. Adam is taking Joey Yard. Adam, up to bat. Great pitch by Joey. Pitchers painting the inside corner today. Strike two. Two and two count. Strike three tips the outside part of the zone. Great pitch by Joey. Yes, it did. See you later, number one prospect. Luke Bradley up. Strike one hits the bottom part of the zone. <sighs> Two strikes to Luke. Strike three. Yep, 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 yep. Scoreless through two innings, we have a pitcher's duel on our hands. The Redbirds choose to put Luke Bradley in the game. Looks like they're strategizing. I don't know what they're doing, but they have a plan. Steamrollers, we just steamroll. I'm rocking with Kyle's cleats today. Swings on a high one, one one. Five two. Hey, hey, six balls, six balls. KCBL plays with five balls, that's why he started running the first. Swings at a high one, which was ball six, but it is one out in the inning. Oh, Kyle. You sold. We need to trade for hitting. Strike three. Redbirds are still perfect on the day. Joey up to bat, waiting to see who they put into pitch. I mean, it's just Joey. Two outs, they decide to keep Luke in for the top of the order. Hey, this guy's been in the league before. Have you faced him? Yes, you have. Hit a home run. Big guy bat right here. Which team can advance to 2-0? In play, Chandler picks it up, and Joey will have himself a single. Breaks the no-hitter for the Redbirds in game five. All right. They decide to keep Luke in again. Strike one. One one pitch. Takes a nice cut. Two strikes. Three two count. Oh, foul ball. Strike three. Luke gets out of the inning. Okay, now I'm gonna take the mic. Whoa, I saw that. I'm sorry. Can they get a run on the board? Matt Foster back in the game for the steamrollers. Oh, hits him. Hey! Matt even grunted on that one. Great two seam. Chandler says that two seam was not that good. Can he hit this one though? Yes, he can. Kyle picks it up, fumbles it, and Chandler will be safe. Let's go. Speed kills. Chandler runs all the way out there. He ran three times as far as he needed to go. Great pitch. In play! Fielded by Noah. Gets Chandler at second. Great play by Noah. And Blake will be safe at first. Great play out there by the steamrollers. That tipped it, I think, the bottom part of the zone. One on one. In play! Noah will catch it for the second out of the inning. Two outs, 
Great defensive plays there by Noah. It's okay, man. That's just off the handle. Can this game stay scoreless? Great. Matt is one strike away from bringing us to the fourth inning. Strike three tips the inside part of the strike zone. Matt has himself a great inning on the mound. Bro, that ridiculous. That kind of ridiculous. We are heading to the fourth inning, the final inning, scoreless. Each pitcher has a six out maximum. Adam has two outs left. Luke has one out left. Kyle, up to bat. Ball one. According to Chandler, I'm eligible for two more outs. Bold of him to assume that I will be getting two more outs. Oh, foul tip to Kyle Belcher after that foul ball. Strike three. Great screwball by Luke Bradley. And he is out of bounds, so Adam Knudsen is coming in. Nah, it's too, it's too hot for warm-ups. Oh, great riser by Adam. One on one. Oh, he went three, two. He went strike three. Joe DeMeo is the final chance for the Steamrollers in regulation. 4 0. Makes contact 4 and 1. Joey goes. We have a full count pitch with two outs in the top of the fourth. Four, two, count. Yep. Strike three. Never a doubt. Redbirds. Pitch is scoreless through four. What an absolute pitcher's duel we had today. Some of the best pitching we have seen in this league in today's game. I think the goal here is to score because I do not feel like pitching anymore. I'm not going to lie to you. Do I flip the hat around for this? All right. Rally? The only way the Redbirds win now is on a walk off. Joey DeMeo in to pitch for the Steamrollers. See if Chandler can bring his team to 2 0. Strike one. Me and my boys stand for the Chandler slander. Isaac tells him to swing bench coach over there. Oh! Walk off home run for Chandler! And that is ball game! Yes! Let's go! First at bat in the bottom of the fourth. Chandler's third home run of the year brings his team to 2-0 for the first time. I don't need this water anymore. Oh, yeah. You better watch it. The first time. You better watch it. Walk-off hey! home run. Hey! Let's go. With the walk-off home run off, Joy DeMail gets a water bath. Wow. Redbirds, we just couldn't get them all together at the same time. Uh, but, you know, we're finally able to get one out. Big time player. Hey, you told me to swing, so then I swung. <laughs> I should have threw that like maybe 100%. It wouldn't have gone out. Oh. Oh. Chandler, you're the player of the game for the second time this year. Looks like Prime Chandler might be back. What happened this game, and what was the strategy on the mound? It looked like you guys were targeting Joey and Matt most of the game. Yeah, so we were targeting the better hitters the entire time. Uh, there's a rule in the league where you got to pitch at least three batters before you switch, um, unless you get two straight outs. So uh, Adam and Luke pitched absolutely amazing today. And uh, yeah, I think our game plan coming in was really smart, um, targeting their top two hitters. Redbirds, new team this year, finished last last two seasons, and uh, it's great to see them win a couple games, uh, but the Crutchers will be back at some point. 2-0, baby. Earlier this week, your teammate Kyle Belcher gave up a walk-off home run in the Kansas City Blitz Bowl League. How does it feel to follow in his footsteps? You know, at the end of the day, kind of sucks. Uh, don't, I don't like to lose, but I mean, I know I threw a decent pitch, but Chandler's just a good player. Duke could hit, so. Are you mad that the Redbirds did all of that on the mound, but their pitching changed? You know, I'm not mad about it. I mean, at the end of the day, it's smart, but I mean, it gets a little bit annoying when Adam comes in when you're going to the plate, so it's just like, it's kind of a free out, so. So, the Little Cubs Field Tournament registration is now open. A bunch of Blissful Leagues will be there. We'll be there. You got to check it out. So, uh, one of the first links in the description, check out that registration, the biggest Blissful Tournament of the year. Make sure to follow Swisher Blitzball and KCBL. They're traveling from far distances to be in these videos, so uh, make sure to check out their channels. They also have Blitzball leagues. Uh, Drew, how are you doing in your league so far? I'm 2-0 right now, and I'm batting like 800 because the slimes suck. All the Comer merch is one of the first links in the description, and make sure to check out the team jerseys. 
They have team jerseys everywhere. You can put your name and number on it, support the players in the league. And we will see you in the next video, game six coming soon. Oh! Walk off home run for Chandler! There's a wasp. Punch the, it was a wasp, the thing was like this big.